Way of him, this is the Wally Show, and uh, we have John Christ with us. This is exciting. What up? I'm here. Yeah, now, yeah. last time you were here it was over a year ago, and we had like this deep conversation about yeah. therapy, and I don't want to like crutch on that, but recently you posted something on Instagram talking about something that, that you had like done. seems like you're definitely crutching on it. I will yeah, crutch yeah, on yeah. it for a minute. I don't, of all, you know, I post a lot of things <laughs> every day. I post a story every day. Oh, really? Yeah, I this just is the one. That find like, the therapy hey, ones. Get him in here. Uh, <laughs> talking to a therapist, had a few good conversations conversations with the good lord i actually talked to them i was like i'm kind of unhappy about some things in my life but i need to be kind of angry for my job like i need to like complain about things so you can can you like fix me but also keep that and they were like we can do exactly that see like uh, i get that okay, they didn't say that <laughs> <laughs> I don't wanna, like, this seems like a strange place yeah but it, it that is like uh one of my favorite comics, his name's Sebastian. He has a bit about why his wife is always like, why are you always like, like this? He's like, I like to be bothered. Yeah, you know exactly. I, mean? I, like, I just like, Ugh. It's like, where it, yeah. your strength comes from. Like yeah. being angry is like Samson's hair for you. You yeah, know? There you go. Yeah, that's one way of putting it with a lot of product. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And if you cut it all out, then what do you do? So right. You go to uh, this retreat camp. Yeah, like, is it a, a summer what camp you make for it sound comics? Like a, it sound like a cult. <laughs> yeah, well, it was. I think. <laughs> I mean, a summer camp for comics. Did they have a zip line? <laughs> you know. <laughs> no, then we did the trust fall on day oh, one. Good. Yeah. No. So, what was this and why? It's a, okay, it's a place called On Site, and it's a, it's right out here in uh, Cumberland Furnace, Tennessee. And I had heard about it from Don Miller's book. Oh, really? Okay. About, uh, Scary Close. Yeah. And he talked about going there, and the 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 main thing, obviously, they take your phone. They don't take it, but you're adults. So you're like, hey, you know, phone, right? And you're not allowed to say what you do for a living. At, you can't discuss what you do for a living. And so all of us are very, I'm very wrapped up in mine. So okay. Like, if I'm just out on the road as a comedian, I'm like a god, not to brag, but like, <laughs> I'm not, not, you're not that funny. <laughs> Let's bring it down. <laughs> Out on the, so like, but but he, it, here I'm just like a guy, like getting my oil changed. Right, and you think like th they, everyone loves that guy, the comedian guy, the Instagram story guy. So when you first meet me at the airport, or hey, what's up? We love your cut. You're gonna meet him. Meet God. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> As a representation, and I ask them to get saved. Uh, no, but who is the like? What if? What if you? Let's say radio was like no more for you let's say you lost your voice or maybe i've lost my radio job before yeah and it throws you into you're kind like, of a tailspin yeah, that's your you, identity you, that's all you have exactly and especially me as a man i think are v way more like wrapped up in like you meet somebody hey what do you do for a living uh well i am a contractor oh so let's talk about that's that's where they go. Right. It's where you, you know? start that's, that's, like, that's, that's all you I have it's right. so like the first it's funny because like i've been to this place before the first it didn't work the first time. No, it, <laughs> <laughs> oh wow! Well, no. We got a repeat okay, bro. customer. <laughs> it's coming for you. Too I tried well. to. I tried to describe it as like a uh, as like a shower. Like it does work, but you you, you got to do it the next day. Okay, it doesn't. It, you know what I'm saying? It was. It was. I, I'm only. I only went back because it worked so well. Sure. Which is like uh, on the brochure. Yeah. <laughs> John's back for his eighth time because oh it really he's works. Like, uh, he's crawling back. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But like the first day, the first day, because everybody there's like 60 people there and we all have dinner and stuff like that. And we literally sit down and we're like, what's up? What's <laughs> like, where are you from? And he's like, I'm from like Columbus. And I was like, oh, I've been there one time. And then we we're just like. I was doing a comedy show. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, you know, we nothing like, to say. It, yeah. Nothing to say. And then you, you're in this like therapy with these people all week and you're trying to like kind of guess what they <laughs> right. like, I wonder what he mm -hmm. like like this is like a look of somebody that like does something yeah you know so, <laughs> so, I, I had a comedian that's nice yeah. well no I had nice a comedian uh, I was on a cruise ship and I met a comedian once and he he looked at me and he goes so are you in music and I'm like well yeah. I'm adjacent to it you're you like I'm um, down the street yeah. Yeah, yeah but like it so everybody's like you know and then you realize that some people like it's funny because when you leave, everybody like goes and gets in their like cars. And but now everyone, the kind of the last day, everybody yeah. says like, "What do you do?" And then we all cut. But right. then it, it's crazy how your opinion of people changed. What do you mean? Like someone's driving a Porsche, and then or like oh. yeah, or they're say like, "Hey, I'm like the uh, like the like the president of like a university." I'm like, this wow. guy was just like sitting next to me, like 
crying about mm-hmm. when he got bullied and when he you don't right. see him like that were when, you the one crying it's okay yeah i was like this other guy yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay so i was crying a lot i was crying a lot. and yeah, that's yeah, cool yeah. that's good let's best. talk yeah. about this because yeah. i actually want you to uh, help uh, me with something that you've learned from oh, your yeah. therapy i've been and, following a lot of your social media so I, if i got a list of things that we oh, could good. probably yeah I'm just oh, good you you, yeah, you yeah, can yeah. you can speak into this because uh i trust me you don't have the market cornered on uh dysfunctional um um, not in this room anyway. So uh, like when you go there, uh, like I had seen on your Instagram post, you were like, look, I'm going out on the road yep. and uh, it, the road can mess with you. Yeah, the and road it can, does mess with you. Yeah, yeah and it can yeah. get your priorities out of line. Yep. So you were doing this as like a tune up to get ready for that. Um, I think the, so we just got off like a 12 week, like, bus tour which was like entirely too much and i joked at the beginning i was like i looked at the schedule i go this is gonna send me to rehab like this <laughs> this is a lot yeah for, so like out there you wake up you got walk through meet and greet sound check uh show uh post show like there's every minute of your day is like regimen and you have to be the comedian guy yeah you gotta always be funny all these people are like yep. no they're you're there for him and this and as they this, i get it sounds funny but they describe this like kind of like inner child that you have like in the at on site so like there's this guy this insecure overlooked as a one of eight kids never really like acknowledged kid i'm tracking with you <laughs> yeah 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 all right so he so he is like he never got any attention like obviously i have to do this for a living right like if any therapist was like mm. yeah this makes sense do you try <laughs> right. like were you like overlooked as a kid and like bullied and like yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Check. Like, oh, this makes sense right so sometimes you see people that are like a uh like a like an er doctor or they've been through some kind of and they are now like everything that you do for a living and why you do it, it all kind of ties in together. So there's this like, I told this, you're going to laugh at this, but it's not, I mean, it is funny now. <laughs> <laughs> so like I told this story, they, they go back to like traumatic experiences from your like childhood. Oh, delicious. No, not, not traumatic. <laughs> well, all right. So I'll just delicious. tell you for an Ooh. example. <laughs> so like I was homeschooled, right? So our, it was our. So traumatic. Yeah. Yeah. That's They're like, okay, you're a comedian probably. Uh, <laughs> or a serial so, killer. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. So one of they were like, hey, John, uh, like when I was a kid, I would ride my bike to the library, which is like t- uh, two miles away, which is like a big deal mm-hmm. for a homeschool kid. Like the library is like our Disneyland. Right? <laughs> 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 That's true, actually. That's a little embarrassing. We loved going to the library, right? Cause, so I rode my bike one time to the library by myself, which mm-hmm. is like I was one of eight. There should have been another. I was 10, probably. There should have. Someone else should have been involved. This is kind of how our house was, kind of just whatever you want to do. And there was the loose, no one was really watching, but not in a good way. Like, <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> somebody should have been like, where is he? Yeah. Anyway, so I wrote to the, and I was at the library for however long in there. I got all these books, had this huge backpack and I, and I came out and my bike got stolen. Oh, really? This is like the 90s, right? There was no like locks. or right. like, I don't know. It got stolen. So I, like, no lo- I was expecting no cell phones. No locks. There's no, this is <laughs> the back 90s. before locks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they had those in the 90s. <laughs> Look, your parents weren't even watching you. Yeah, they're, they're not going to give you a lock for your yeah, There's bike. no helmet. There's no nothing. <laughs> yeah. So I, I, I remember like walking home. This all this, and it took forever. And I had this huge backpack of books, and I, I probably was like, "It's funny now," but I was probably crying and like, I, <laughs> I'm "Hilarious!" Yeah, yeah. <laughs> sorry, I laugh at other people's pains it's, out of nervousness. It's funny. Yeah, so I walk into the, I walk into the house. Everybody's like eating dinner, and I was like, "Hey, my bike got like got stolen," and no one believed me. I was like, "No, my bike." It was just kind of one of the when you're a kid, no one like. All I needed was someone to be like, "Hey, dude." Let's go back there. I'm going to go. Let's get in the car with me. We're going to go back and find mm-hmm. it or look for right. it. Everybody's like kind of, no, it didn't. And I was like. I didn't walk two miles from my health with all these books. Yeah, but, but as, a, as a, a kid cannot, he doesn't, a kid cannot handle that. Now, adult John now can handle it. So a lot of the things. Barely. A lot of the things. <laughs> barely. A lot of the things I struggle with now, like uh, people saying things about me on the internet that are, are hurt mm-hmm. my feelings. If I'm reading it as this John, he it makes him he can't handle that. This guy can, right? So like somebody, there's some you, you ever said something to somebody and it's like, oh, that's like a sensitive topic, right? Or like, oh yeah, they they went into you like, pushed a button, yeah, some kind yeah. of like if like you made fun of me for like my hair or like my, I could care less, right? It's not or my 
appearance. It's not a but thing. Can we push? <laughs> yeah, there is one. There is, if you if you guys if we were all best friends and I yeah. heard that y'all were like hanging out and right. didn't like invite me, it yeah. would be like mm. destroy. Me. That's your button, or like that I'm okay. feel I'm left out. Gotcha. That no one is. I'm like kind of voicing my needs and no one is listening. Okay, because that's how as a kid. But this is anything about like. You can make fun of my job or, or mm-hmm. there's a million things that are sensitive. Like you want to all go around and share what y'all are sensitive about? Nope. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, the, the, our room is, can be a brutal room yeah, yeah, you yeah, know, yeah, like yeah. in the morning every uh, day. And yeah. so you try not to let them see your, your weakness because these <laughs> two are like Panthers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They'll find it. Oh yeah. We do know we get, what it's yeah. like to not be invited. Cause recently we found out Zach has a four year old daughter and we found out. Oh. When we got back now to we're getting into work, it. Yeah. that he had invited just Wally over for the birthday party. Dang, Who did bro. he not invite? Two of us. So in essence, he looked at, he goes, Wally, nah. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. what he did. Yeah. We yeah. spent yeah. half yeah. of our days together. Yeah. We I even offered to babysit for free. For free. Yeah. Nothing. Still have it. Yeah. Nope. yeah. The bouncer Brutal. didn't even question me when yeah. I showed up. Like, uh, it was that on exclusive on yeah. of a party? Yeah. There was a rope. Red velvet. Come on in through Yeah, for a four year old party. Bottles of wine. Seems strange. That's how Zach rolls, though. <laughs> but it's not like you 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 try to like they they're like we can't fix you in a week. I was only there for a right. week. So like we're not gonna like fix you. But what what we are gonna do is give you like the tools to like hand. There, I mean, people were like, you get into everything about like the why are you like the way mm-hmm. that you are, right? And then, and I go, all right. Well, if you make me like, I need so like Michael Jordan or like let's say like. uh yeah, Michael Jordan, Kobe Bryant, or Tiger Woods. Like a lot of those guys, they know all three of them. Or I don't know about Kobe, but at least Tiger and Michael needed their dad's approval. Okay, so bad. And it, there's you, there'd be like he just didn't want to be good at golf. I just don't want to be a good com- comic. I'm up at two a.m. like writing jokes, getting better, obsessing over. But that's what makes me great. But if they like fixed me and I didn't need, I wasn't insecure anymore. <laughs> then I wouldn't. Right. Right. Right, you no. wouldn't care. Why, Mike, like Michael Jordan, all he cared about was putting that ball into that hoop. That's all he cared about. Right. To the detriment of his personal life, though. Right. And Tiger Woods and all mm-hmm. of the same thing. And they were like, hey, what, what brought you here is not going to sustain you going forward. Right. So this anger of like, I'm going to prove to people that I'm mm-hmm. worth it or somebody like that is also going to, it's going to destroy you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, see, I did the angry humor and was was fueled by negativity for most of my career. Right. And yeah, then yeah. when you come to, like, say, Christian radio, yeah. and it's completely different, and it's happier, and anger doesn't work right. here, yeah. what do you do? And, like, <laughs> I— Bottle that up. Yeah, yeah. I, you, you just push <laughs> yeah. it down and one day scream yeah. into a pillow. That's yeah, what you do. Right. Uh, you know, As you cry. Yeah. <laughs> but, like, for me, I always, like, I feared getting happy because if yeah. I got happy, then— yeah. It meant I wasn't going to be funny anymore, and that's it. Yep. And I still wrestle yep. through that, and so that's what I, I want to uh, get. Well, we to. have a. Uh, I got a bit in my show. I go. You ever just been like mad at somebody else's like happiness every day? You just like see them at Starbucks like laughing, and you're just like, <laughs> <laughs> or like you like uh, it's kind of more of it. Like I see, you see like a couple like a dinner like laughing and talking, and I was like, I bet. It's not going well. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, you write this oh, whole narrative. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah, that totally. can't be. Right? Betty's yeah. done that. You guys are very similar in that uh, <laughs> regard. I, I, said, uh, I go, I was on, this is a true story. I was on a plane. It's like a two, three hour flight. Sit next to a guy, like no headphones, no like iPad, phone, nothing. Just like. And he just sat there. Killer. I was like, yeah. what are you just happy with your <laughs> Are you just okay with your thoughts? What, how does this work? Yeah. You don't, you just whatever's in there, you just okay with that bubbling up? Yeah. Like a, yeah. I, I got, I need, I need a distraction. Yeah. I don't, yeah. yeah, I can't be just, you just. That would be disconcerting on a plane too. It's definitely I don't like somebody. any weirdness yeah, yeah. on a plane. Yeah, you attract it all the time. Yeah. Dude, yeah, there's something like. A guy about fell me. asleep in his lap the other day. Yo. Yeah, that was weird. And you're like, the touch felt good. Actually. No, actually <laughs> not. Because then my next flight of that leg, a guy had a night terror and like elbowed me. So it's just like, I yeah, just have that. weird like flight. Like thing. when they sit, like, uh, they were like, you, when you're, I'm in the exit row, like, sir, are you willing? I'm like, no. Yeah, <laughs> like I say yes, but I was like, absolutely not. No, I'm, like, this is every man for himself. You think this plane is sinking over the Atlantic Ocean, and I'm helping? The, I hate everyone in. <laughs> like, I hate everyone. Like I'm getting out the door and closing it behind. Like, really. like, he, like, the, the, like this guy, his clip, 
clipping his toenails. Like, <laughs> yes. do we? Oh, do we, do we want him? Yeah, no, <laughs> no. Save it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that guy's last. He went to yeah. the back of the line. <laughs> At least if I'm if I'm helping people, I get to decide the that's priority. True. That's I should. True. You're you're in. You're. I don't know. I don't like. This. <laughs> okay, well that's a tough one because it's usually women and children first. But that crying baby. What do you do with that? Oh, plus it's 2019, so like it's all equal. So to do, uh. do the, okay, never mind. All right, anyway, go to commercial. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, we got John Christ with us here, uh, comedian extraordinaire. And I'm curious because you go to this camp, you know, thing. Okay, it's, it's not it's, called a camp. Okay. <laughs> you go, what do you, you call, call it camp? then? Did you get a t-shirt? Like a, uh, Did it's y'all not, all have matching t-shirts? It's not, no, there's no, there's, it's not rehab, but it's okay, also yeah. not a camp. It's, it's like a retreat. A, yeah, it's like a, I don't know what it is. I guess it's they never It's getting said. off the grid. Yeah, it, it, yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. So you go to this thing to well, kind of work on yourself. Uh, f- sure. All right. Here's the easiest way to describe <laughs> Did it. Did this work? Did you really go to a thing? Like, I'm starting to think you didn't even go. No, it changed my life. All right. <laughs> so if you let's if you work in a factory, you can vacation to the beach. If you work in a cubicle, you can vacation to the mountains. Mm-hmm. If you work like on this thing, there is no vacation. Right. There is none. Because if you're like, hey, it's going to be relaxing. Let's go to like Cabo. I was like, if this is coming, yeah. this is the source of all my everything: anxiety, depression elation, everything. This is the source. So if this is coming, I'm not, I'm not going to be like chill. Okay. Right. So this thing has to go. So there's a very, and people are always like, I'm going to like, you know, these like reasons people say they're not going to, I'm going to leave my phone in like the kitchen at night and I'm not going to, or I'm going to have a, you're not doing that. Right. <laughs> or I'm going to put the Instagram in the second page on a folder so I don't look at, stop. Yeah. You're not doing that. You're addicted to it. Right. Everyone is just, let's just, Call it what it is. So if you can't leave this thing, you can't. You, you can't. You can't vacation. Okay. So that's like kind of the only. So option. that's what they did for you. They took it away. In essence, some an, an adult was like, "Give me this." Yeah. Okay. And, so and you, the, just like camp. Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway, so the camp I went to. Yeah. 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 Did your parents yeah. send you? Like, did your parents drop? Oh, they were concerned. Actually. It's yeah. not yeah. camp, yeah. but it's your parents dropped you off the, yeah. the sleeping yeah. bag. No, I don't want to go. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Okay, so here's what I need you to do for me, because I don't think that I am strong enough, honestly, okay. to go and do that. I really oh, don't. Dude, it would change. I can't wait till you go. Come, I, let's, I'm gonna come back in after you go. I I don't know that I could. Like I I, I was raised in a different. Oh, dude, you're the you're oh you're, you're the perfect candidate. Perfect I think candidate. Betty and I would start a, a I think fun. You're, you're the only one at this table that hasn't done therapy. Yeah, yeah. I am. I am. Yeah. And you're yeah. the one that needs it. The that most. needs it the most. Yeah, that's a fact. <laughs> That's a fact from you? (laughs) We brought you here. So wait a minute. The only way we we can get it's on camera if it's John. (laughs) You come. Let's invite John on the show. Yeah, Yeah, I thought we were interviewing you. (laughs) All right. So let me do do this for me at least because, again, I don't have the strength right now to do therapy. But I'd say it's great for other people. Yeah. So I realize. I'm already so excited. I'm so excited. I realize my hypocrisy, you know? Uh, I wouldn't call it that. So, like, what did you, what is one takeaway from this thing that you went to that you're like, you know what? This helped me. Because I think you and I, whether you want to admit it or not, you and I are wired similarly. Yep, and yep. so I, I'm curious if there was something that you go, dude, this, I think, concept could help you. Okay. Well, I – so every everybody in there has, has – has, like, I would say, like, hey, like, I have a, fam- a family member like, that, would, that I think needs to go or could use it. Right. I'll be like, hey, I'll – pay for you to go. That's not really how it works because you have to want, you have to be open to mm-hmm. the uh, experience. Yeah, it's not going to work if you're yeah, like, he's like, oh, I don't right. want to go here. It's like, you have to be like, hey, I've like, like ran my life into the ground. And that's good that you got to that point. Yeah, not that you yeah, ran your life yeah. into the ground, but that you had the realization. No, that, it is true. Yeah, I want to yeah. do this You're because right. yeah. it's good for me. And it's cannot, it, it, every, no, I don't think anyone knows the solution, but they're like, the, the life cannot continue like this. So there's, there's, there was people in, you know, uh, broken marriages, drug addictions, uh, bankrupt, various criminal activity, not like, like b- bad, bad things. But is that worse going to people like going to a therapy thing where there are people that are more messed up than you? Cause you're like, I'm not that bad. Uh, <laughs> you know, like, like, good. Yeah, 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 like, yeah. Hey, deuces. Uh, well, we're done here. Like, I murdered someone. I was like, my bike got stolen. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. Like, so like, it's not that bad. We're done. You're good. You're, it's only a day. Yeah. <laughs> you're crying about your bike. This is why you're here. <laughs> But here's the thing. We laugh, but it's Wally fun. has all of this anger that is just pushed stuff yep. down uh, I'm there. Our, I'm so excited. There's like a pressure you. cooker yeah, going yeah, on in yeah. here. 
Uh, and he, I think you think that you're not to that point, but I don't think anyone's not at that point. Yeah. Does that make sense? Oh, no, it does make sense. I, yeah, you're making me angry, but no. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll uh, just push it down. The, the, I, th- like, what was shocking to me about all everyone that was in there and, you know, people, um, cheating on spouses and all, all these, all these types of horrific things, right? When you, it's like, I'm trying to think of, I don't want to get into this. Well, maybe if you didn't, if you, let's say there are people that hate Donald Trump, right? Right. There's a lot of people that, yeah. I bet if you, if he could connect with his emotions and we sat down together and he was like, yeah, like when I was a kid, like, like money was a way to get mm-hmm. my parents kind of approval. And I right. started these mm-hmm. like businesses and then it like, it never, I could never really get, and then I got them bigger. And then I, and then I started like, maybe TV. If you could connect with him on this level, you'd be like, oh man, dude, I love yeah. you. Right. You would. <laughs> right. You would. Yeah. And yeah. same for Hillary Clinton or whoever is on the other side that you hate. Right. That you, if whoever the person on the internet that is like, these people that like literally send me into like depression with the things that they yeah. say about me. Like if that guy was like in your counseling group and he walked through his story, you'll be like, oh, dude. I get that. Yeah. I, like you, you know, you really will. I'm not trying yeah. to like do a thing. You'd be like, oh, he's like, I get very like, I feel like no one's listening. And I lash out at these people that I think are, are, are celebrities or I get so angry if you're like, oh. I probably everybody you. every every person in there there was like a and I've had like you know dated girls that are are not you know not like let's say just for the sake of Christian radio not walking with the Lord right, right. and then you're like but then he, there was a girl in our group that was like very like uh had a lot of those similar like experience and I was right. like oh I never saw it like that where it came I from. never that you want to like hug them and like love them versus like this mutually like using each other. And mm-hmm. you're like, Oh my. And then you, yeah, you see your parents in a different way and your coworkers. It's I would like, imagine no. empathy. It would teach you 100%, empathy. You know, yeah. it, when you're vulnerable and you're walking through that and you want that, I would yeah. imagine you, when you look at not an issue, that's a big thing with yeah. like politics right. or, you know, issues is when you see it as an issue and you don't see it as a person, yeah, that's, yeah, that's where human. it's yeah. dangerous. Yeah. But when you start, we've always said, man, like before you go join a picket line, go have yeah. dinner with somebody 100%. that's on the opposite side just, of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you might see them completely differently. Yeah. It might not change Jeez. your resolve yeah, yeah. because you have your just conviction. Maybe a smaller sign. <laughs> yeah. like, hey, this is not the, yeah. just maybe the, yeah. yeah. Just a, yeah. It's just a little <laughs> hand sign. I saw that on, on Instagram yesterday. It's like, there was a, uh, there was two people on either side, of, and the right in the middle was a, was a, on the ground was a. To this guy was a six, and to that guy was a nine. He's like, neither of y'all are wrong. You're both looking like it's a nine. He's like, no, it's a six. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But he's looking right. Like, they're like, yeah, you're, you're mm-hmm. he, just because the other person is not. They're not wrong. They're just looking at it in a different way. But if you're so like, ah, and then because like, that's what everybody like. We're walking around on the verge of like a like a. I like got out, not an outbreak, but like a you're losing control. Mm-hmm. Any these these people on the internet or whatever I struggle with, whatever you struggle with, has the power to like take you all the way to the ground at any time. Yeah. And and leaving there, like are these things are still going to exist. My goal is to not not Here? be on the internet, but like you, there's a, they give you like pra- like see, it's not a Christian place. Oh really? It's not. Okay. But I think that is what got me in trouble in a lot of ways. It's like, hey, John, just like read the Bible more or like maybe. Right. Mm-hmm. And there was there was like Jewish people in there and Muslim. Now it is in Tennessee, so it's. <laughs> some, the, some feeling, yeah, some thread there, yeah, of faith. There's a, maybe, I was yeah. like, is that David Crowder right here? There's a Chick-fil-A on site. <laughs> <laughs> One of the sessions is led by Dan Cathy, but it's not like <laughs> specifically. It's, at least yeah. it's catered by him. Yeah. <laughs> but it, it like you, you're, you're, so you leave out of there and these people are like, hey, I'm going to go back to this broken marriage right. now or I'm going to go back to this job where this boss yells at me or I'm going to go back. I'm going, it's like kind of being like camp in a way that you're away from everything. And you're like, but you go, you're going to go back into your, I was joking the last day. I was like, I love how we're all like laughing and joking here. Like we're not going back to our awful lives. <laughs> <laughs> like we've improved, but our right. lives, 
are probably gotten worse because we're not around. Mm -hmm. So like your boss is still going to be terrible. And these people on the internet are still going to say terrible. Your boss isn't terrible. I'm sure. No, yeah, 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 yeah. No, I'm great. Or you, or traffic on the way to work still is going to be what it is. But now you have like the tools yeah. to like deal, deal with that. to see it yeah. differently. Yeah, yeah. Because, or to, yeah. yeah, it's not that you. It's not going to go away. Right. But you're like the very practical. Like when I got last time, they were like, "All right, here's what you're going to do. Like you can't, you can't tour this much." When you go out on the road, you're going to get in nicer hotels. You're going to, like, calm yourself down. You're going to eat. You're going to exercise. Like, very, very practical and, like, you, like things to, like, ground yourself when you do get, like, tr like when you're just going to lose your mind. Like, I want to go, like, ah, and then you want to go make some, a bunch of poor choices. Mm -hmm. Right. But, all right. Let's think this through. And, you, and, and you, my gift to all these people in my community is now a healthier. Right. And oh. everyone else is like, I t my so my sister who works for me. Yeah, your sister's great, by the way. Yeah, she the is. best. Way yeah. the best, Chris. Oh, by oh, by uh, far. 100%. Yeah, so I'll give you a perfect example. So I, when I, whenever something goes wrong on the road, I immediately like lash out to her. I said, wait, what are we doing? Why is there no, who are these people on our comp list? Why right. is there no, not like in a diva way, just like, what is this rental car or what? That seems like a Devo thing. Uh, yeah, yeah. They're like, why, why is my <laughs> Bentley why are these a four-door? Why are M&Ms in the bowl? <laughs> not in a Devo way. They're yeah. not in a Devo way. Totally, yeah. yeah. That came off really good. <laughs> so, but she, so she does all these things all week to set these shows up, to make them run. There's mm -hmm. literally, I, there's a thousand things that have gone right that never get acknowledged. Right. When one thing she, and I go, hey, I just realized this about myself. I, they told a story in there about, about a mom, this this blew my mind. A mom that was like with a, a, the son was borrowing the car every night. So the son would borrow the car. Hey, you got to be home by midnight. You got to be home by midnight. He would never come home on time. All right, twelve thirty, twelve forty five, twelve fifteen. Never get home. And she was driving her nuts. She goes, "All right, tonight you got to be home by midnight, or else you're grounded for a month." And he came home at eleven fifty five, and she was bummed out. Oh, because she wanted to, to ground. To, yeah, she to, wanted to the crush retribution. Him. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And I was like. Yo, yeah. that is that is right. So, yeah. so I, I, and I, I, as soon as I got out, I called my sister. I was like, Hey, do you think, like, I feel like I jump on you for every little thing that you do wrong? And she's like, Yes, 100%. Yeah. And I go, I'm so sorry. See, that's good that you had right? that conversation with her. Yeah. Because honestly, though, she was probably messing some things up just to get even with you from childhood. 100%. <laughs> yeah. She's, like, she's the guy. one that yeah. stole the yeah. bike. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 And where's my bike? <laughs> but he, but this is is this happier, healthier John is like a is like a, I was like, man, y'all are all going to be like all these people in my group is like such a gift to like your families. Yeah. To your, like. Like uh, there's a girl in there that her mom like is is very like always the victim and and right. then always like you never call me you never hang out with like it and and for someone to be like hey mom I love you and like but like enough enough and like her problems are her problems and if mm -hmm. you, you can't caretake for all these other people in your life you're like hey I like I got to get healthy for myself and like enough is enough of this but well, they'll teach you the skills to like do that. Well, I'm glad that we have a healthier John Chris. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, less funny, but healthier. No, you know, <laughs> you're doing well. I don't think you're less funny. That's I'm good. feeling a group hug, though. Yeah, maybe, no. okay. maybe, when, maybe, maybe when the cameras are off. Uh, yeah. <laughs> day four. Or maybe we should keep going. Yeah. Day four. Yeah, this is a camp. You're here yeah. for five days. We do. Yeah. I'll, do you know? I'll, I'll tell you a real, like, campy thing that we do. Okay. You want to do it together? Yeah. Singing around right. the kumbaya. So, ever put your thumb out. Okay. And then turn it to the left. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, hold on. I'm not that smart. No, that, no, the other one. Oh, sorry. Right hand. Yeah. All right. Left. So then you put your thumb in here. I already hate this for no. the record. And then it Just makes so you know it makes like a circle. Everybody put the thumb in. Okay. You gotta bring it in. Wait, yeah. What? No, you got the other. You got the wrong one. Oh, yeah. That? So we got oh. like yeah. So we got this big group of like what is that? ten you of like us. You can let go now. <laughs> yeah. this big group of My like ten stuck. of us. And there's like this circle in the middle, and you're like, I'm throwing in uh shame and i'm taking yeah. out peace or something okay. that's very culty huh? it would be that yeah, would be yeah, hard yeah, yeah, for yeah. me on like nah, day dude, one, nah. yeah, on day well, yeah, one yeah, yeah, maybe yeah. day four when i'm broken down haven't eaten a little bit i've already shaved my head <laughs> 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 you know handled the snakes yes. was, the kool-aid comes late <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah 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 so but there's all there's like a there's a the what i went to is like the living centered program that's just everybody they're like ah oh, you it seems a little but like there's stuff for like you know, grief, uh, trauma, right. military, uh, uh, broken relationships, divorce, all the possible life after loss, all the possible things that, like, shake people up. Like, you're like, it's a bummer that you, 
it attra- like people have like a traumatizing i say like uh, i'm selling out all these all these like literally like arenas in my and was so like amazing for my career but and all these people are like we love you we're so excited people wait in a line to like meet me but i i go home with these very small minority of people that speak ill of me. I right. take, those are those are the people That's I, it. That's all I go to bed with. Really, yeah, yeah. truly, like like the, the, all these people in line that are like, "Hey," I was like, "They doesn't matter. They can't be right." Right. They, they, I, I go, "Why are y'all here?" What you know what I'm saying? And it's very comfortable to listen to the negative voices because that's what you've told yourself. And yeah, so it's, it's like, hey, Wally is not funny and he's not entertaining. You're like, this, it's validating everything. Yeah, you're like, thank you, because I this is what I or whatever it is. Yeah, okay. I'm not funny. <laughs> I'm not entertaining. It's okay, oh, buddy. Wow. This is time for the group hug. Yeah, yeah. Oh this is, yeah. <laughs> I need your thumb. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was weird. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Well, there you go. But the, but they're like though those you know just. Yeah, we, I mean, I got to talk about it for forever, but I know it's good. But it's good that you uh, found that you got to wake up and wear that every day. All these people are walking, all these people out here waking up with the, the things that they were 10, 12 years old and just put that on and then go out to work. Well, it encourages day. me, though, too, to see you get to that point <sighs> and still be doing what you do for a living. Because for me, yeah, it's the yeah. same way. It's like, OK, I can lay down some of that stuff yeah, and it's yeah, not going to. Yeah. In my career, it could make you, know, you better. Sense. Yeah, it make you yeah, better. Maybe. Is, is that yeah. a crazy concept to you that working through stuff would make you better? Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. But you so. don't like it, it. It all goes back to like you as a kid, because that's when all these. So like when you then and that uh, like, I would tell a lot of stories about how uh, mine always kind of came back to the same thing, right. or about how like Goodbye. I would, yeah, you know, or some <laughs> something similar, where like I would go to like. I played tennis and like practices over like 5.30. Like all the kids' parents came for, and I was still there. No, right? No parent mm. there sitting on the curb. Coach can't go. Right, gotta like, wait hey. for you. And he's like, where? And this is before like, I couldn't call and have a cell phone. Just like yeah. it's getting dark. And it's like, this for a 10-year-old is like- I get that. Right? Yeah, it's like that. all mine kind of came back to the same type mm-hmm. of that. But there was other things that did. It was like, yeah, never really like a kid made fun of me for like how I looked. I was like, yeah, but it wasn't, Mm-hmm. I don't know. It didn't. It didn't because that wasn't my like insecure. Right. It was like, exactly. yeah, it's not real. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I knew. I knew that. Like, hey, you're funny looking. Yeah, yeah duh. Yeah, I, kinda, yeah. <laughs> I own a mirror. Kind of own. That. <laughs> yeah. Well, so the the comedy in a lot of ways is like is like a coping mechanism for oh. pain. A hundred percent. Yeah. So you look at lots of times people get angry with comics on the internet or they cross the line. I was like, yeah, yeah you don't understand what like that's. They're not just trying he's to be offensive making, yeah, a lot of times. Not, it, sometimes they are, but like yeah. sometimes you're like, ah, oh, yeah, it's too far. You shouldn't right. have said that. But like, you, you, like my one of my favorite comics is named Josh Blue from uh, he's from Denver. He has cerebral palsy, so like, okay, yeah, and hilarious. He won last comic. Yeah, I saw him. Yeah, up together. He's so, great. Hilarious. So he'd be like, so what do you do when you're ten and you at your first day of school and the teacher's like, go out and play recess. All the kids running, having a good time, and your arm and your leg don't work properly what is to be done with that you can hide and be sad and depressed and a victim or you can just like hey he he made a joke he's like or something like uh i can't control my arm so sorry for the girls that i slapped on the butt on the way in <laughs> like it's, a, it's it's funny right and then, and then all the kids are like if you make one joke the first day in middle school you were good like, yeah, then you're fine right <laughs> and then all the like the shame of like the that you carry around, you're like, oh, so it's like it it kind of like dissipates in a way, or like everybody told a story about their childhood, or so, and you're like, oh, like that's a thing, that's a real, like, oh, so mm-hmm. I don't have to like wear this, right? Like, mm-hmm. No, yeah, like, yo, and, and when that's you find powerful. out other people had this a similar experience, because well, yeah, 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 or like well, you're like, oh yeah, your parents or your this school or your like okay there's, yeah. there was nothing in there that somebody could it's like there was a guy that was like uh you know he's very like running around with a lot of women and stuff like that or like but then you find out like like 10 years prior like his wife that he like loved dearly like died of cancer and he right. never had the and you're like but if you if you saw this guy now like at a bar you'd be like right. ah, this guy uh, but he's then if, that guy then you'd be like mm-hmm. oh dude yeah. you're in like like sometimes you hear about these celebrities that get in trouble for all this kind of stuff or like they're you know they're partying or drinking or cheating on their spouse or like he's not happy he's this it, 
I have nothing but compassion on right. me. It's like he's dying. Is right. the guy that's mm-hmm. chasing around women? And like you think it's like we need to like tear him down. It's like no, he's our he's he's already br- yes, tearing himself yeah, he's down. Tearing inside. Himself. He, he does right. all he needs is like, dude, what, what, like what's up, man? Like, right. It, but it's hard to like p- like a lot of people ask me to 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 take time off comedy or like in a relationship with like a. I have a hard time dating. I haven't had a girlfriend since I started comedy. Oh, really? It's like ten years. Which that would like, be tough because yeah, your girlfriend gets brought into that. Like, yeah, for yeah. sure. Well, I I don't I never talk bad about people, but yeah, you know, in my show. But like, sometimes people don't understand my relationship with comedy. It's right. Like this thing has like bailed bailed me out of pain right. for years. That is a girlfriend. Ye- that is that, no people say that comedy is like my mistress. It is kind of in a lot of ways where like I'm always like it. Family reunions, or like, or like a some corporate, are like trying to like sneak out and like go to the comedy club, right? Really and truly, <laughs> like, because that, like, Tim Hawkins, we always joke with each other. He's like, "Yo, he's like, my kids don't know my name, but I got this new closer that's killing." Like, <laughs> exactly. He's, jo- he's joking, but he's not joking. Right? There's like, an element yeah, to that. All this, all the you know, family problems and relationships and financial, all, all that you can when, when you turn on the mic, right. it's the same feeling. Yep. That is kind of. Over there. Not to be too deep about it, but like for you and for me too, a lot of that stuff, is the coping mechanism was when you were a kid, you yep. were the funny kid and that's how you coped yep. with all yep. that. So yep. it brings you in. You've had a lifelong affair yep. with humor that's been your defense mechanism. Escape. Yeah. Yeah. And, and a lot of- no, In your comfort. Yeah. 100%. Because I could always like get attention that way. Yep. I remember at church when I was like a girl, I would always be like making the girls like laugh or it was always yeah. like a- that, like. And then they always just wanted to be your friend. Oh yeah. my word! Like, what is up with that? <laughs> I'm Sounds funny. Like, I don't have that yeah. experience. That's well, just you're on easy. your own on that one. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, thanks. I guess that's where we got off the bus. <laughs> okay. Well, fantastic. <laughs> but every, there's like a uh, there's like you took this like addiction like uh, in essence there was like a, a quiz so like what do you what do you there's like obviously like like uh, pornography and right. alcohol and eating and then gaming and like your phone and like what what do you when you're finally like done with all your jobs and works and it's a lot, what what do you where where are you going? Right. What to handle it? Where right? So right. like people were like, well, you should like read the Bible and like pray more. I was like, yeah, that that it, it, it's like it's so it there's different consequences for different type of behavior, but like my, my like working a lot is one of mine. And right. like, there's like, oh yeah, that's like my I want to like get into like a like when I somebody I went to this I made this viral video of every parent at Disney. Oh yeah, that was good. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah and somebody good. asked me in a meet and greet, they'll go, Hey, did you when you were down I was down there for like a whole day. They're like, Hey, did you like ride any rides? I go, No. Yeah, you didn't you didn't <laughs> experience or enjoy any of it. I go, Well, I I I go th- like you whatever enjoyment you get from watching my videos, right. I got my own issues and problems in life. I can turn on that phone and have this I and literally go into that world. Like I can be the swag mm-hmm. pastor right. or the football coach or the millennial. I'm literally not in I'm not me right. with problems and issues. Right. And it, but you can I go that that is turning on that camera and walking around and be like, oh I can't kids get on here. Where's McKenzie? <laughs> like that is way more fun than like Space Mountain. Waiting in line for an hour yeah, and then buying like, You're literally that, not there. Like, yeah. I'm not in my body. Right. Yeah, which is like an escape for like me and it has been like for forever. Yeah. I, oh, I totally identify Until with Until you come here. Yeah, <laughs> right. Strip it all yeah, down. <laughs> bring it all to the surface. You haven't cried, so that's yeah. pretty good. And I kind of feel yeah. like there's, I see a lot of similarities between oh, the two. Yeah. I just feel like y'all have different avenues on yeah. how you do your comedy. Like you right. chose radio, you yeah. chose stand-up. But even with the, the phone thing that you yeah. were talking about, like he has this thing where he he cannot be separated from his yeah. phone. Like it mm-hmm. has to be yeah. with him. And if I text him, he is I mean, right on it. Like yeah. if we don't reply, he will come and find us and murder yeah. us. Oh, right. not yeah. Texting okay. Back. I believe well, let's yeah, talk yeah, about yeah, this yeah, then. Yeah. I know why you're bringing that up. And you can it's probably real. see where this is going. Yeah. So I, I text John 
hey, let's uh, hook up and let's do coffee. I'd love to have you on the show. And he's like, yeah, great. No problem. I'm, I'm, I'm living there now. So we're all good. So then I start texting I'd him. I'd rather people not know that, but you just What's that, that for everybody that I live here. Oh, you do? No, I'm just joking. Okay. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, are you that big? Yeah. <laughs> Chill. Anyway, I was like, hey, I'm at like, don't tell my address. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, I, so then like, I'm like, oh, good. We're going to get John on the show. And they're asking me, okay, when's he going to come in? I'm like, I don't know. I'm texting him. And then I, I hear back from him like two days later. Yep. And then we, I text again. And then it's another two days. And they're like, I thought you were best friends. I'm like, I never said that. Yeah, but, that, yeah, <laughs> yeah, but, but, we, but we're here. I know we're yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. But for me, as somebody <laughs> that like, you have no idea how much you wounded me. Okay. All right. Well, no. All right. You feel like you're in a relationship right now. Right? <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> this is all your right, good, No, I have been in relationships like this with women, not a guy. But <laughs> I mean, no, I'm not saying the voices like, the, the, all right. So I, that is not, <clears throat> I had this li- literally conversation three days ago with my friend Beth. I go, that is not how I, if you don't text me back for two, I don't receive it as like a hit. He doesn't like me. Right. So, so I'm behaving in a way that I, I wouldn't mind. Right. It's, but, it, but it, but it does come to other people in this way. Which, but you feel better. No. Look at her laughing. Yeah. yeah. I feel better, but I, I'm like, I don't know. Does I like, literally I would come in and I, they're like, is he going to be on the show? I, go, I don't yeah. know. I think he hates me. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like that so, was my response. So, like my friend would like message me and then I, it was like something about, and I just wouldn't respond for yeah. like a day and a half or something like she goes I'm good so this is in like a healthy way she right. went hey y- when you do this to me it makes me feel like unvalued and if I and and that you don't appreciate me and you don't care about my friendship if I cared about you I'd be like oh my bad that's not how right. I was meaning it but right. I'm I'll be like, hey, I can't talk now. I'm gonna, if I said, hey, right. saw your text. I can't get to my calendar right now, but I'll text you back tomorrow. Right. You'd be like, great. Yeah. Right. We're good to go. Yeah. yeah but I was like, I gotta get. I can't uh, right. do this right now because I'm not in front of my calendar. Right. So I was like, when I get back, I'm right. gonna. Mm-hmm. But you saw like a. Uh, and yeah, and you just said if. I cared about you. I would have done this. <laughs> yeah, but I didn't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If we were that yeah, close. hypothetically, yeah. there's a ten year old in here yeah, that never got ten year old Wally. I'm is. so yeah. sad right now. I, I, I feel a little awkward because I feel like I'm like sitting next to a Do couple. Me a trying to explain, I live like, here. I still love it. Yeah, yeah. I uh, a was commercial. There's no commercials. Okay, yeah, I, I was good. like not uh, gonna go to therapy till you came here. Now I'm thinking, do you got that number? We'll send him right now. Get him one of these minivans and send him out there. Okay, I want to play a game. With you and and Thank lighten you. things up, I know, <laughs> and uh, do something kind of fun. And this is going to be in your wheelhouse, oh, and oh, okay. you should win this. We're going to play a game called Quiplash. Okay? okay, I'll explain it. You should win this. All right, um, but is it me versus you? No, you're actually you're versing everybody. Oh, okay. And okay. Becca does traditionally very well at this. Betty actually does well at this as well. I typically do the worst. You don't do good. I, you yeah, I don't do game. well. Yeah, so uh, homeschooled. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> We have him. This is The Wally Show. And we have comedian John Christ with us. And we're going to do one of our favorite things. It's play a game. We play after work a lot of times called Quiplash, where the goal is to make other people on the show laugh and earn their love, which is what you've been doing. Hey, since come on, dude. I'm right, that's right up my alley. <laughs> right up my alley. Because you want to be the funniest and get somebody to pick your uh, joke. OK, so it's a it's oh, a video a game. This is a lot of pressure. <laughs> A murder weapon that should be added to the next version of the game Clue. Okay, vote for Participation your... award or the word <laughs> of God. <laughs> yep. Oh, that stinks. I was going up against you. That was no. me. Oh, that was yeah. Becca. Yeah. Oh, man. I didn't oh! get it. Uh-oh. Yes. I don't find that funny uh, yeah, as a millennial. Yeah. <laughs> wow. A bad thing to hear the person cutting your hair say. You work in radio, so no one will see it. At least your bike didn't get stolen. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> I like the callback. Uh, everyone vote? Just, I, I just barely got in. Oh, no! Come on. <laughs> the Jigawali. Yo. What would you do for a Klondike bar? Melt the polar ice caps or not return Wally's tank? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that's inside joke because John hurts me when he doesn't return my text immediately. <laughs> nice. And that was yours too. Nice. Wow. That, wow, he's caught on. Hey, that that I worked on out, I figured out how they play this. Two game. painful <laughs> levels. <laughs> A good punishment for an unruly child is to simply look him in the eye and tell him 
Check your heart. <laughs> you're oh, adopted. you're adopted. Oh, that's so bad. Yeah. yeah that was a good one. No, that was a good one. Of course, we're uh, that was adopt. brutal. Yeah. Uh, adoption's beautiful, guys. I know. Oh, 100%. Still funny. Still, still very funny. Yes. <laughs> All right. So at the end of round one, Man, John, come so on. Fast. Boom. We're tied. Well. Yeah, that's right. John making it extra funny in his last 13 seconds. You're not sweating this Seven, as much six. as I would have thought. And you truly have the most to lose here. What a moron would say at a museum. I thought I said Mormon. No. Oh. <laughs> I like this painting, but it needs dogs in it. Sweaty tube top. Somebody took a, uh, a quip flash. They, they gives you an option if you can't come up with one. It gives oh, yeah. you like a random thing. Okay. I bet that's Betty because she's not looking up and she took a random <laughs> thing. Oh, wow. Yeah. yeah. And if anyone voted for that. Thing. I can't vote for either of those. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> no. What is wrong with you? That's funny. <laughs> That was a quick flash. Okay. Now it's personal. <laughs> a rejected Jelly Belly flavor. <laughs> Wally's microphone or organic belly flavor. Yeah. <laughs> belly button lint would have been good. Oh, come on. Yeah. I step it okay, up with fair, your organic. We'll yeah, yeah, I got personal too. <laughs> the hardest part about dating that. in 1892. You die at 20. <laughs> no burner account. <laughs> Wow, that's somebody that spent wow. some online dating time. <laughs> I think this is the two single people. Oh, that's uh, funny. No, it's no, John and Wally. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Those are, oh, my gosh. <laughs> a really dumb name for a barbershop. Crank it like a chainsaw or I will oh, cut oh. you. Crank it like a chainsaw has like to be rock. Has to be. Oh, oh, Becca. I know. I couldn't think of anything, so I was like, I'll try to get Stellar. Betty's boat. I, oh. I didn't know what Crank it like a chainsaw. Because that's like her. She loves Spain, of course. Yeah, yeah. I, know, I know the song. I yeah. do know the song. Oh, well, this is the last round. Yes, this is it. All right, come up with a flashy wrestling move with this word in its name. And the word is beard. Okay. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you hate it when you're like, the joke is Ten sitting seconds. there and I can't find it? All right, everybody's in. This is for all the marbles at the end. Smeared beard, lady beard, the triple chin beard, bye bye beardy. Oh, that's good too. Wait, we don't. Uh, you vote for two. Come on. Oh. Oh. Oh, Becca oh. could be coming from behind uh -oh. with the gold. Bye bye, Beardy was good. How's it going to finish up? Oh, Come boy, on. This is, this is killing me. Come yeah. on. Oh. Yes! Oh. yes! I beat the professional oh, comedian. Well oh done. my goodness. Hey, That's gosh. a miracle. Respect. Well, I thank you. I appreciate that. And I appreciate you uh, being on the show with us today uh, and spending some time losing to me. So that thank was a blast. You. Hey, I'll <laughs> see you at open mic tonight. You want to come? Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs>